think it's more about mobility, to be absolutely honest. Yeah. I don't think it's that I'm stronger later in, later in the session. I think I'm able to maybe connect better. That makes sense. So, yeah, because I'm pretty stiff, you know, because okay. I lift a lot. So so usually what happens is, is people beat my wrist straight off, you know. And then later in the thing I start controlling it. <laughs> um, I'll try not to bully your thumb too much. <laughs> yeah, go for it. Fairly gentle with this arm, at least for a while. Yes. Well, that, well, as you can tell, I'm not tearing through your thumb. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, it, also because I'm in pain, so it's yeah. we're both injured. Yeah. <laughs> so I, what I'll do, I'm going to hold off, and what I'll ask you to do is lean onto, see if you can test your own, own sort of own lean, see if you can test your arm. Okay, okay. go. So yeah. sideways yeah. or. Well, just a like bit of both. Yeah. So so you're trying to kind of test this. And, and a bit of endurance. Oh, that's good. Yeah, now that will be the time of your feet. <laughs> so, you see, it wouldn't take yeah. much then to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Feel a little bit. Yeah. yeah. So if you can, if you can hold your own body weight for a decent amount of time. I'm telling you. Yeah. I, I mean, I used to do a lot of rock climbing, so. Yeah, I've never done any. <laughs> so. Oh yes, actually, we should have. Except he doesn't like arm wrestling. Um, Harry Harrington, he's, he's a club, sort of a club member, but he only does grip. I've seen him first. Yeah, so he, because he's a rock climber, so I'd love to if you guys... You I haven't climbed in a while, but I used to go a lot. Well, he's, he's, a, he's, a, he's, a, he's, a, he's not like massively strong yet, he's, he's, he's on the up. Yeah. So, so actually, you know, I think he's... I, I've been doing grip stuff just to improve his art, his, his rock climbing. Mm. Actually, he, there was a thing on the yeah. bouldering that he didn't manage to do. Yeah. And then, um, I'm really happy for him. And then now he was able to do it, and he's yeah. like, it's... A lot of... I don't know, as you get better at rock climbing, it becomes slightly, I think, less intuitive. That there's something more instinct. crazy pinch strength, and um, like, it's just friction, and I... It's, there'll be like a sloper which is kind of like that and you just have to like if you think about it you'll fail yeah, yeah, it's yeah, just, yeah you just have to have really strong yeah fingers it's a bit, a bit like um, train i think there's a lot of guys in our club who are really technical with the way they think of pick things apart and for me it's kind of like well i'm, I'm, I'm good at safety tools you know just about yeah. what i'm good at but um, i've noticed you're quite um open on your setups yeah so they're almost like you that, that's all right if you can get those fingertips in so okay. if you're gonna hang back yeah then you need to guarantee you've got that cut okay um otherwise um if someone takes that cut you've not got anything else uh, yeah um, so, so generally, I would try and st start with your shoulder a bit more. Okay. Yeah. 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 Give yourself a few more options. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. I mean, even if you end up out there, a lot of pros, some pros, they'll deliberately hang back. Yeah. You know, but but they know they've got a sweet spot to connect, yeah. and they can usually usually they've built up enough strength that they can rely on their calf. You know, whereas us guys, you know, who sort of are, you know. You know Lifters and beginners, um, um, maybe you have to rely on other things. So. Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> I feel like I can put my whole body weight on this. Yeah, this go ahead. Be, my feet are up. <laughs> yeah, good. Feet off the ground. Good. Good exercise for me. <laughs> Yeah, very good exercise for me. Okay, I've got one foot on your thing. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's just, it's fun, it's just how strong you are. <laughs> well, it's amazing how that, that strength just collapses when someone takes my wrist. Yeah. So that's the dark thing. So that's why people don't tend to play into my hooks, you know. Yeah. Well, people who do beat me in the hook like that, the guys who beat me in the hook, um, they'll run away. Okay. So so they'll kind of really oh, get me. and really pull me to that side. Yeah. I've never been beaten in a sideways high hook by someone. That makes sense. Um, but I'd love it if they did. <laughs> um, you know, it'd be nice to have someone sort of test that. There is a guy in our club who's actually got showing promise. Um, the guy who, 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 didn't, who, who 
one forty eight to cancel, okay. but he's like automatically hooking. Yeah. And he's got, it's really promising. Yeah. Oh, it's so nice stuff. And actually Oliver's amazing at hook, but but Oliver doesn't go sideways at all, he'll run back. Yeah. You know? So which I really struggle with because I've got a short arm. Yeah. So basically because he runs off. Um, as soon as I'm about there, it's very unlikely with his big, big wrist and hand. It's very unlikely I can hold that because I've got only that left. Whereas if I can keep him up here, I've got a chance, you know. So, so Oliver, I have to be really careful to keep him up here, otherwise he's just got me every time. He's so strong now. So I'm very proud of him, you know, because he was only 14 when he started about 12. Yeah, brilliant. Yeah, good for it. I do like, I think I'm a fan of the top rope kind of. Yeah. Yeah, that just feels more comfortable <laughs> to me. I like this, we're kind of working purely on middle table at the moment, and then we'll sort of maybe wait till, till um, how, how do I pronounce it? Is it Inge? Inge? I'm not too sure. No, say, say. Yeah. Say? I will okay. ask him. Yeah. That's yes. Best amazing. way of pronouncing people's names. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, not that I've got a normal name. I've got the name of a of a six foot two black American. <laughs> Actually, I was named after an American guy. My parents oh. met in Israel. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna try that. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> um, funnily enough, that is the sort of thing that. It, it, it's so the the um, improvement curve is ridiculous. It's like it wouldn't take long for you to suddenly yeah. build that. You know, uh, I, I, some of my housemates they're like, oh, like how's the how's it going? Yeah, it's really fun. Do you want to try it? And they'll tease them <laughs> yeah, and they'll film up. And then one of them I was out at the pub with last weekend. Mm -hmm. And they started telling some random people we met that, oh, my friend here arm wrestles. And then I'm like, oh, no. And then I'm, <laughs> everyone's like, well, like, show us like how to arm wrestle. And like, some of them are really strong, but and, um, I was a bit Easy sore. And I didn't, not. Like, the top rolling surprisingly didn't work too well on them. But then, like, as soon as I went for a hook, I it, felt I had an amazing connection. Yeah, you know why? And I was trying to tell them what to do, and they, they couldn't really. If you don't have the separation, oh, okay. then... Um, it really puts pressure on you. To, yeah. It's very, very difficult to, to do a really clean top roll in, in the pub. Yeah. Um, generally, I would, um, um, I, I would. Ooh, they, it, loads of flying ants around, isn't it? Yeah. It's going to be one of those evenings, isn't it? Bouncing off of us. Off. Oh, oh, that's, uh, that's good for the spiders. Yeah. So basically, I would say in the pub, really twist for the sky. Yeah. <laughs> and bring them in your side yeah. because then even if they're stronger than you, then they're they're, they're compromised. You know, so hmm. um, I love the fact this has got Mazarinko equipment spot in the middle. Yeah. Yes, and if anyone's wondering, that's what the handles are supposed to look like. And this thing, this that's from my old table. Yeah. And and unfortunately, there's a bolt missing, so they're going to have to send me that. But I've ordered another one. It should be arriving tomorrow. I mean, it doesn't make like, too much difference. Oh no, it's, it's it just, just looks rubbish. Yeah. So. <laughs> These gnar gnarlings quite nice, but yeah. that wouldn't last as long as you think. Actually, oh. it doesn't take long to wear that down. Yeah. So, um, okay. So if you twist up, then what I tend to do, I tend to s sort of aim around there. Uh, yeah. Try and sort of turn down. Yeah, that the, that feels yeah. very uncomfortable. Yeah. So what you want to do, you've got a nice angle on me to do the same thing. Yeah. So you've got a very nice angle facing the arm. Okay, but do I? Pull in um, my hands more. Well, you, you have to really, you lock in. Yeah. You can be a bit open. Because I, I felt like I could get a good connection like on my bone well, no, to you, yeah. and that felt strong. But oh, yeah. When you twisted it more, it just yeah, felt like you, you I had need to, to something. What you have to do, you have to go, uh, see my arm, you have to yeah. go aim over the arm. So, uh, so basically, um, rather than going into the other guy's bone, you're, trying to you, go you're doing a little past. trip over it. Okay. Yeah. Over. So imagine you're trying to go there on the other guy. Can I? There in okay. my case. Yeah. So in that case, you, you're trying to open me up in that direction. Yeah, and, and th your hand will go in that. Oh. Yes. Yeah, so, yes. Yeah, so like it's actually close to pronating, but not quite. So a high hook is actually really close to pronation, okay. and and it, at the end, at the top here, 
you can finish off by pronating. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you run out of room. Yeah. Yeah. I know. So yeah. So I, yeah. So what I'll do, I'm just going to put up a bit of resistance, and you're going to try and keep it nice and bring me in. Yeah. Um, easiest way of bringing someone in is to start with your elbow reasonably far forward. Mm -hmm. That way, um, I know it's counterintuitive because a lot of guys they like to sit up on their arm like this. Yeah. But it's kind of yeah. So you're going to try and get me into a position where you can just come yeah. down on me. Yeah. And your whole body is going to be coming down. So you want to be pulling up down on your arm and lying on that cuff. Yeah. yeah. Okay, up, 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 up. So you're going to work into it. So, so grip up. And weirdly, I'd always say if someone's a hook arm wrestler, then you want um, no air. Okay. You know? But with a high hook, you actually do on the air. It's more like a top roll setup. Okay. The reason is it gives you somewhere to hook oh, down uh, into. Okay. You can come down onto the arm. Yeah. I down onto the thumb. Of that setup, I think. Yeah. So you want a high hand, or you'll be in trouble. Okay. Because you see, I've got a high hand. Yeah. Easier to go into you. Yeah. So you're you're setting up your wrist like a top one. You want to be a bit more. Okay. Um, simpler setup. Just keep a bit of air under here. And keep it nice and tight up the front. And you're going to basically. You can see this is a natural angle on you to to yeah. open you up. Which surprises me that no one ever goes for it on me, but you know, go for it. Yeah. So then you're going to be going sideways and running away, pushing down with those fingertips. I still don't know how to push down with the fingertips. Yeah, so it's something uh, that once it clicks, you'll be really good at it. Do you mind swapping to left? I don't mind. So that's understandable. These things are so tight, aren't they? Blimey. Funnily enough, these things, these things I never realised, these oh. things screw in. That's cool. Yeah. I guess it makes sense. If, if anyone wants to know about Mesmer and Carl, they do. Yeah. It's such a good thing, really good idea. I'm, I'm loving this table. It's not, it's going to get torn to bits, so isn't it? Uh, this black and <laughs> red there. What's the club colours? Com colours? So funnily enough. You requested enough, that or they just had it? Well, um, it was one of their standard colours and it's just as well because it's, yeah. um, um, I mean, it's, it's red, black and grey are our club co colours. So it's sort of like, why would I need to go for anything else? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's kind of a fortuitous. Yeah. Of course, I can't hook on my left. But okay. on well, my left, I can. I've got a really horrible drag. <laughs> I mean, really nasty drag. Okay. Yeah, go for it. Yeah. Uh, no, no, it's okay. So I shouldn't <laughs> talk. I should. <laughs> no, no. Because nah. I, I, I'm, oh, no, I don't want to. No, um, it's just good. Let's let's warm up. Yeah, okay, that makes more sense. <laughs> yeah. Well, yours is actually clicking more than mine, actually. <laughs> I've always had very clicky wrists. That just means you've got some flexibility there, which is actually a good thing. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah. um, often it's better to be on the... A lot of the best arm wrestlers are a little bit more flexible. And they, they, yeah, they're not necessarily... The, they don't start out as the most... Uh, I mean, even Devin Lowett, who's got flexibility yeah, he issues, yeah. he's still got super really uh, yeah. flexible wrists. I'm always impressed when I see someone like him doing that motion because he's got quite a lot there. Yeah, I've got, I've got a feck all on this. Yeah, I feel he's, um, he can like go way This is up. how much I can move that hand up. <laughs> <laughs> Did you do anything or is it just always I've got like a bone condition. I've got yeah. a, same reason I had the ribs removed. So I've got a bone con uh, bone bump there which oh. gets it in the way of everything. Yeah. And, and weird, it's really weird because I've got like a for instance, the bump there, mm. which everyone has, yeah. um, I don't have it on this half oh, hand because the bone is there, but the bone, because it's twisted, it's, oh, in, it's, it's in there. So basically, you imagine where the between my between the finger and the wrist, the bump is sticking in there. So yeah. basically, where it's usually up and out of the way, out and out of the way, and um, this one. The, the bones twisted, so basically, it just everything's in the way of each other. Do you arm wrestle much with your left? No, I try to practice on it, but yeah. I, I never compete. I mean, yeah. I did the sit down championships, yeah, um, which was hilarious. 
but I had a better chance on the sit down to be honest simply because um, people couldn't get into a comfortable top roll position which was perfect for me I love the sit down completely yeah and my neck did buy the sit down leg space okay. so that they're lower table yeah and you can buy them off Mazenko yeah so um uh, oh yeah so if we do this To be absolutely honest, I feel a lot better than last time. Because last time it just um, kind of felt like I did. I did get the impression that you've done a lot and you're probably not having a lot of You know what really annoyed me? I was training last month for the Summer Slam competition and then um, the, my competitor pulled oh, out. Enough. So now I've gone back to my grip training. Yeah. So I'm sore in other places, I'm just sore from all the pinching to be honest, and very specific places. Yeah. But um, on a positive, it means I'm not, I've not been doing the arm wrestling training, so, so I'm not as sore. That's a, I mean, uh, it's not a bad way of doing things, but I mean, yeah. recover from something. It kind of makes me think, well, I don't know, but, but I know that if I stuck with the arm wrestling training, it won't hurt forever. Yeah. I just need to get through that where, but but I just love the grip training and, uh, as soon as I um, as soon as uh, I mean you know um, Tim Dungeon Boss uh, the, the guy who was running the Summer Slam I think he's the one running um, he was asking me if there's someone just yesterday or the day before was saying is there someone else there's another guy uh, do you want an arm wrestle in the Summer Slam said, you know to be quite honest I've changed my training you know yeah. because I you know I'm not ready uh, anymore so um um, it would be fun, but I'm, I'm now I'm booked to see my parents on Sunday. I mean, it's just too late. Yeah. I'm not going to go all the way down to the coast unless it's, you know, um, I'm really ready for it. And and who's this guy he mentioned? Him? He said this Osman or something. And, and I'm sure he's a great guy. He said, oh, he's an amateur. He's a novice. Why would you deliberately <laughs> put a novice against me? The the only novices you'd put against me would be... yeah. You know, if he's if he's if he's a small guy, what's the point? You know, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So the best thing I can do is sort of um, pull down. I put my hand down. That's all it is. Go for it. <laughs> I don't want to fight that because I can feel the thumb. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how. Yeah. I need to work out something against that. Yeah, well, um, what do other people do? They tend to work around my thumb. Yeah. So basically, don't work. Um, if you do a dragging top roll, you're working into my thumb, and actually, yeah, it's not very good for you. Whereas well, if you can find a way around it, in other words, kind of go around my thumb. Then, then, then I can't put the brakes on you. Yeah. yeah, you were saying this before, and I didn't like it. Just kind of look at my hand and s come up with some angles. I mean, know? the only thing I can think of is to try and hook. But yeah, you can try. No, nope. just <laughs> I'm holding you off. I'm. Um, I wonder if it's your ring. I wonder if that has anything to do with it. Big deal. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. That's yeah, alright. Funnily enough, um, there is a rule in professional arm wrestling that yeah. jewellery is not supposed to be, uh, is not allowed unless the players agree. Yeah. So well, it's like a gentleman's that agreement. Makes sense. Yeah. So, okay, any better? Actually, it is a little bit better. Yeah. Okay, cool. I can still feel. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll try and work into this. Oh, yeah, that's good. I, that's I don't know what that is. It's a weird. That's an hour hooky top roll. Yeah, but you've got some so nice, nice work thing to it work feels on. Feels very good. Yeah, fall away. Fall away. Oh, that's, that's nice. It's horrible for me. That's yeah. nice. Yeah, that's okay. good. That's good. Very good. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> 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 Tell me if I'm hurting your thumb. No, that's it's it's not cut of the ring, I think. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I'll I'll remember to take that off for you. Good. <laughs> <laughs> that drag is a lot. 
Yeah. <laughs> you could probably do the same thing to me if you and I'll this is just a sort of a lap drag because it opens me out, you know. Okay. That Actually, uh, uh, the only problem with dragging is because I'm because it's a lap drag, it's not really back pressure. I tend to open up my arm when I do it. Yeah, well, I'm opening, I'm putting pressure on my own hand, mm. so so potentially if if my own hand fails, yeah, then then it's a, it's kind of a the wrong thing to do. But yeah. usually the guys I'm going against are sort of the more wristy ones and cuffy. Yeah. Oh yeah, that was good. That nice, nice little after bit. These are really painful to lean on. <laughs> I think mine's not. I quite like mine. It's not bad like that. It's from my uh, the old uh, getting impaled on these things. Oh. Yeah. Oh, like uh, oh, yeah. I, I see what you mean. Yeah. Oh well, it's I have an advantage when I'm so getting used to. I'm like, because it's brand new, as soon as I see any marks, I say, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you should just bash the hell out of it. Yeah, I always feel like I'm shoes. For some reason, you get trash on it. I'm going to try something else. So, um, mm. it, this is a push down and lap drag. So, so go. Oh, that is interesting. Yeah, I don't want to match that because I know my. Then I can come over. <laughs> so your hand doesn't really move at all like that. Well, I can't move my hand much anyway. Yeah. So that's. Um, I, you see, this hand I can do all sorts. I think that kind of plays into your advantage there because your fingers are so strong that when you do that, I mean, there's yeah. it's so bones that I'm fighting. Could, yeah. So what you could do is, um, again, you do tend to start with a very low hand. Okay. Um, the, the, the thing yeah. is, if you want to end up with a low hand, it's better to start with a high hand. Yeah. Because then you've got something to work into off the other guy's hand. Mm. It's always a little bit, I, I think I would say it's always better to go for a high hand initially. And then when I'm, you see, if I start with a low hand, yeah. I've got nothing to drag into. That's you know? fair. It's just that I need something yeah. to grip. You know? I think it's my old rock climbers thing of like, get as much to. Get yeah, onto. You're, you're a bit grippy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Um, I would say if you want to grip, um, sort of start kind of quality of contact. So sort of line yourself up nicely, mm. and and with a with a aim at something. Okay. So aim at something on the other side. Yeah. Hand. Yeah. Okay. Give yourself a little target. Yeah. So, I mean, with me because I can't really move my wrist or <laughs> hand much. Mm. And basically, I'm sort of pushing down into. Your, I'm pushing. Oh, I so I push forwards. Yeah. And I pull back. Yeah. Yeah, so see if you can put, put pressure on my thumb as you push down, mm -hmm. open up my thumb. Because my left thumb is not as strong as my right thumb. Yeah, I mean, it's I don't have world records on this hand. So yeah, but you're probably not far off it. <laughs> yeah, this is this is way down on the other hand. I mean, it's over, it's decent. But I'm I mean, sure it's, it's completely, you know, it's a joke compared to that hand. Yeah. So so there's all there's hope that you can actually okay. um, beat that. Yeah. Yeah, that feels horrible. That's good, nice. I've never really tried using That's my nice. triceps like that. That's really nice. That definitely worked. Okay. Yeah. So let's see what I can do to sort of counter that. Oh, that's nasty. That's good. <laughs> this is great. Okay. Try that against other people. Oh. It'll be even more effective. All right. This is this is um, ding ding moment. <laughs> My fault moment. It's quite a fun move. It is, isn't it? And yeah. and the good thing about good thing about pushy movements mm. is that they use less energy. So you're kind of saving the rest of your arm for them when you need yeah. to need it. Because I feel my, my triceps are probably a lot stronger than my biceps comparatively, just because I don't, know, I don't really ever do biceps. Well, I, yeah, I never do. I never, never do curls. I got I got yeah. I can I can any day of the week do the old. 40 kilo strict presses, but but the yeah, you know, I'm not going to curl for four kilos, am I? So I've you know, enjoyed pressing more than, <laughs> and I think my pulling is just in my back. Oh yeah, yeah. well actually that's a good, another good thing about rock climbing, just the, the back muscles. Yeah. Um, it, again, it's something you can control. Yeah. The the this this sort of this space you can, but you need in order to utilize that you need to. Separate. You need separation in your chest. Okay. Get those shoulder blades apart. Sort of hunch. You know, yeah. yeah. And, and it get, gets mobility in this position. 
if you're back here, you can't use it. Yeah. So generally, the people who want to use the, this back, kind of this flexibility, they tend to hunch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they tend to do this. Yeah. Um, yeah. What uh, On YouTube, you can really see it. A lot of the Eastern European guys are great at that. Really good at and, and it gives them all the angles in the table. A lot of options. Yeah. Yes. Especially if, if the, the um, if you're medium size, it means it gives you a range in both directions. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I feel that's all I can see when the, the pressure on my thumb comes up too much. <laughs> oh, that's good. I feel like I can push you off the pad if you try things, but that's about it. Well, you try and push me off the pad. Okay, but when you start <laughs> making moves, then I can push. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, no, 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 no. Yeah. But you've got a nice thing to just, uh, yeah. just remember, if there's, sometimes you're like, oh, you know, it's like, oh, there you go. Just, yeah. You've got an easy way out sometimes, yeah. uh, especially if you're taller, you've got a way of dropping off. So, you know, it takes that option sometimes, you know. You mean drop off as in just... Oh, yeah. So, for instance, you were like, work, 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 and then yeah. you had the option just to take this over, you okay. know. So, I mean, I, I could only do that as I was up there. Yeah. So, so it's something that I can't do. Okay. That's good. Oh, that's nasty. Yeah, because you because I can't hook. Yeah, yeah, and I've got you way over my From side. From here, now. I would be so happy on my light up. Yeah. And here, it's like this is a whole load of trouble. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you had me. I mean, that, that's practice. You had that's me. Yeah. Worth practicing. Oh, that's fair. Yeah. yeah. That's really good. That felt really horrible. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Um, no, I think that's that's definitely a way to beat me. No, I mean it's it's that hand is a finger position, which I can make up. I can do a lot more at the beginning when my fingers are in the space of my hand. So I can really that. Yes! Oh yeah, that's what you meant. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. You need to give yourself um, uh, options, you know, yeah. obviously. And especially when you're going against, it's not like you're going against a weight machine. You're going against this organic object who wants to, who could go into all sorts of places. Yeah. You need to give yourself room to work into him yeah. and into that hand. Is there anything you want to try more with the left? Well, I could try a, a, a very strict sort of top roll. Okay. Yeah. To, to go. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see if I can get more resistance. Yeah. <laughs> to go? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that is, that is unpleasant. It's just strong. <laughs> But, yeah. but that's something you can hook into. You know? yeah. So um, generally speaking, um, if someone, if I'm the same, you know, someone can do that all day to me and I'll feel like, oh no, I'm going to be in trouble. So I have to hook into it. Yeah. That's the advantage of a high hook. It's, it's like, I know I'm a bit repetitive on high hook, but a lot of people just don't use it as an option. Yeah. And it's there all along to save you. You know, if someone's going to take your wrist so easily, just get them... They're working so right into If them. your wrist is coming back, you can twist yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Take the high yeah. road, and, and then you can sort what of... What is the difference between a high hook and a low hook? Oh, completely different things. So, Sorry, yeah. Right I mean, they're, they're quite... Very different hand position. Um, so, hook and drag. So, hook and drag, I, you, know, you tend to kind of grip low down there. Do you feel that? Yeah. yeah. So then I would be... So that's the low hook. And Is that about getting low on the arm? Yeah, you're, 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 opening, you're opening them up there. Okay. And, and then at the end, you know... Because I feel if I get low, surely... It's like, I, I think about this sometimes, I'm like, surely if you can get quite low, then you've got like good leverage. So I sometimes try and do if that. If you can get them on your side, but yes. They, like, if they, they just have up. access to so much strength when it's just... Yeah, but, but again, um, the trouble with hook and drag is the other guy can post on you and you've got nothing to hook oh, into. Okay. See, I can't... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whereas if I'm a high hook, I can... Yeah, there's... You it's a completely different that. thing. Yeah, so yeah. the high hook is all here. Okay. It's all the up here. 
the, the, the hook and drag is all, it's quite a compact, it, it, you, I always liken a hook and drag to imagine you've got a rope attached to your wrist yeah. and you're dragging a very heavy weight across the gym yeah. from your wrist. You wouldn't lead with your wrist, you'd lead with your elbow yeah. and you pull through your wrist. Okay. Pull through that bit. Okay, that makes more sense. Yeah. So, so the, what, what you don't want to do is overtake your, yeah. your elbow with your wrist okay. when you're doing a hook and drag. Yeah. You drag the whole shape. Yeah. That shape, you can pull a lot of weight through that. Yeah. That, that's that's the drag there. I felt that trying to arm wrestle people and we know how to arm wrestle. Oh, yeah. Like I, I felt if I got into a hook, I had so much connection here that Low I could down. just. I mean, they could do what they like, but I, I've got a strong position yeah. and I can just at any time just. You are indeed. Um, and, and if, if you are, if you are, in a sort of stuck inside like that. It's like, oh, I don't know. Um, generally, you're just sort of pulling in that direction, yeah. and, and it really is as simple as that. You're pulling, as opposed to uh, that's the big difference. You know, mm. you, you really are pulling in a hook and drag. Yeah. In a high hook, you're pushing. Okay. You're not really pulling. You're yeah. pushing down. Yeah. So, so it, it, they look similar, but they're really not. The, yeah. the, 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 the strains on your arm are completely different because imagine if you're tra if you've trained this way. Yeah. As soon as someone forces you into a high hook, you, you can't. Well, so so if you try and if you train side pressure, it can it can it can really open up a lot of options. You know, uh, I I think that another Is side pressure. Can you that? Side pressure is literally anything that that goes. Okay. It's it's it, it, side pressure is a directional thing. Because I I feel really weak whenever I try and use some side pressure like. Yeah, so I feel I have to be pulling to have any. I, I tend force. to ha I, I don't like using side pressure, but I get forced to do it against the toes. Yeah. So other than, sort of against novices, it's fine. Generally, it doesn't mean I always beat them, but 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 generally they don't force me into side pressure. Mm -hmm. Pros, it's like hitting a brick wall, yeah. and so I they open me up. So I end up I can't pull in that direction, and I can't push down. So it ends, it ends up being side pressure. Okay. Um, and and you are pushing down, but it's a combination of both, you know. And you're really um, the if you looked at if you look at me in the British arm wrestling championships last year, it, it was um, really I was forced into that situation as well. So um, even though it wasn't what I wanted to do, I, I had a completely different game plan, and you know you end up kind of finding yourself in that shape, yeah. you know, so, so whether I, I it just through default have ended up being a high hook specialist, you know, not necessarily what I would have wanted to do originally, and I don't think I could have done it early on, it's something that you have to be comfortable, get comfortable with, so, yeah. so, I mean, one thing I would do is, um, high hand tactic is, um, it's a much more touchy feely type of arm wrestling, so down here it's more about placing yourself, forcing yourself into position, yeah. whereas a high hand position is very much about feeling the, uh, through the other guy's hand and, and feeling the pressure points and trying to dictate through that, <laughs> trying to di yeah. dictate through the fingertips, you know, um, you couldn't do a low down, you know, so uh, yeah, two very different, you can really mix it up just by looking at how high your hand goes. Yeah. Well, At least we're both, we're not knackered yet. So, yeah. so what I'll do, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to dump my thumb. See what you can make of that. Oh, all right. Yeah, because you were taught, you're interested in the, um, in the inside techniques. So, yeah. <laughs> well, don't push, again, careful. Okay. Protect your elbow. Yeah. So, I'm worried about, oh, if you're going to push forward, you've got to pull, you've got to follow pull it back through. Too. Yeah, I mean, um, you can't really, if you push forwards like yeah. this, without, uh, you're, you're going to force yourself into spiral stress, it's okay. dangerous, but if you pull down, you're able to isolate your arm in a safe way, Okay. so, you, you know, in, in, in doing the drag, you're, you're, um, you're able to get yourself from a this twisty dangerous position mm. into a pulley safe position okay. <laughs> so yeah. yeah so it's really important that you get that drag in okay yeah so 
but it really drags get down off your arm. Probably is now I've got an angle on your hand. <laughs> so you've got to watch yeah. your hand as well. So yeah, fair enough. <laughs> So that, that is a really good stable wrist. Mm. Work with that, you know, line your fingers up, nice simple shape. Yeah. You see I'm already compromised, so you've got very nice angle on me there. Yeah. So so sometimes it's just a matter of looking at the other guy's hand. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yep. <laughs> oh yeah, that's nice. That, you forced me into a hook. <laughs> <laughs> but no, that's great because you kind of. Yeah. I, I, uh, I, 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 honestly, if I was to, if I wouldn't hook, you would have got me. Mm. So, so sometimes it's not because it, you know. How do you stay out of it? Is that just strong, just to keep. Uh, sorry? Just to keep out of the hook. Is that just. Is How that do just, you stay out of the hook? Is that just me having oh, to. Uh, to prevent a hook, you pull. Pull. Yeah, but rather than that, you're literally pulling through the guy's hand. Okay. So, so, I'm, I'm so if you're, that. let's say you're trying to hook me. Yeah. So you try and hook me. So go. Do you feel me pulling? Yeah. It's still like yeah, that's true. Yeah. Try and hook in. Hook, hook, hook. Yeah, you're not resisting it. <laughs> so, so all I'm doing is this. Yeah. It's, it's like. Uh, almost like um, pronating but but it's more of a, a very subtle more stability thing it's rotation isn't it yeah. mm. there's some guys who are famous for rotation um, uh, Anil Gujaran he's a he's a lovely guy uh, one of the British champs and he's sort of famous he, his nickname is Mr. Rotation <laughs> and he'll, he'll, he'll find some lovely angles in people you know He's not always been the strongest guy um, in the room. He's always, he, but he's beaten the stronger guy, you know. So he, he's always been very crafty, you yeah. know. And, and um, first time I ever met um, Anil, um, 2010, when I was at the British Arm Wrestling Championships, and he, he already had his arm in an ice pack. <laughs> you know? yeah. It's like, you know, he would go to some angles that, that would really hurt, you yeah. know. And, and consequently, um, he's very set himself up for n not getting really bad injuries over the years. He, he's just had tendonitis, but but well, the fact is that he gets some lovely angles on people. So, yeah, um, do you have any tissues like this? this yeah, I can get a box, but I always I always yeah. always hold clean handkerchiefs. Nice. <laughs> yeah. I'll get a box. Yeah. Uh, shall I get a box now? Oh, it's, I can probably use it. I've got while. I've got cetirizine as well. If you want it, I've, I've already taken my oh. cases of pills today. It just it gets yeah. me down. It's it's really I mean, <laughs> sorry. It, uh, actually, I suppose it would have been worse if I could have been bothered to mow the lawn. Oh, don't don't worry about. <laughs> it's yeah. At least it's not as hot. I mean, that's <laughs> good. yeah, it is nice, but it's not quite so nice. What's this here? Look that guy, so strong, he's going to turn up and we're going to just be mm. nappy. Yeah, I'm hoping he won't fuck with you. Um, if, you're, um, if you're getting tired on your sort of really good angles, it forces you sometimes into some other angles, which yeah. sometimes... I mean, for instance, if I'm really fatigued, I'll opt... Uh, you know, so this is my kind of right hand leg. Mm. So literally... Um, it, it's kind of my leg will tend to come up or I'll plant my foot forward. Most people do, even if they're tall, short, whatever. If I'm getting knackered, my left leg comes forward. Oh. Because I'm isolating the pull. Yeah, I feel that's... You moving there makes me want to... Yeah, it's a defensive me. posture. And, yeah. and it's not an... It's, it's a very good... Uh, for putting the brakes on someone, so it, it's, I use it more on my left than my, on my right for obvious reasons. Because mm -hmm. what this left has so few options that if one item gets fatigued, I'm out of options. You know, yeah. there's only a few things I can do on my left. So if I was to come over here, I'm, I'm giving myself a bit more time to, you know, to, to hold him off, to, to pour through, yeah. pronate. Mm -hmm. um, 
rather than the, the correct boot position should be over here. You'd think, hang on, go against the bone, you know, that would really put the brakes on. Yeah, but I'll put the brakes on, but I can't do anything with it. Yeah. I can't do anything with it. Here, I've got half a chance, you know. So, um, you know, sometimes you want to take the middle road, you know. Um, unlike Mr. Rotation, you'll go one extreme or the other. Okay, so. Again, you've got such an open arm. Do I? Yeah. I felt like I was swung out over that. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, that's all right. Good. So, what's your plan, Stan? I have no idea. See what feels different. Okay, yeah. Punch myself in the face. <laughs> oh, that's nice. That's good. <laughs> really good. Um, you dangerously close to an elbow file, so yeah. try, try to. I was trying to keep it. Good on idea, then. That's why you start the elbow forward. Give yourself mm. a bit of room. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Really nice. This is good. Don't you go for it. <laughs> oh, interesting. And, uh, yeah, so th this is you're forcing me into an angle now. Go, yeah. same same thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying with my left foot forward, which is yeah. changing things. I feel I can get a bit more force on things. <laughs> so I'm allowed to go. Ooh. Yeah, that makes a chicken wing you. Yeah, I, I felt like that was uh, at least I can get out of that easy. Yeah, well, a slip. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you got my thumb. Oh, sorry. That's good. That. That's fine. That's, that, that, yeah. that caused the old death. Yeah. I wanted to see if I could catch you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's interesting. Yeah. <laughs> so in other words, don't let me slip. Yeah. Yeah. That will be really good in an amateur match if you're going against another novice. Just bully him down. <laughs> okay, well, yeah. just try yeah. and get him to slip and then... Well, no, him. in other words, hold on. You know, okay. you were like clinging onto my thumb. Yeah. It was really uncomfortable. Oh. Yeah, you were, yeah. You were like hanging onto the end of my thumb. Because I feel, <laughs> in practice with you, when you get your thumb in, I'm, I feel like either let him win or my well, thumb's Well, I don't damaged. tend to do it, you know, because it's like... It's I mean, I mean, I imagine a match that probably helps a lot. Is there... Well, um... I don't imagine no, because in most asked. matches, most pa matches, people tend to go very far out on me or very far in. Okay. They don't tend to go down the middle because yeah. they know I've got strong hands. So it really very rarely gets tested. Fair um, enough. Yeah. So, so go. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe slipping should be my my practice. Yeah, as well. I, it's right. I, I shows I've not got the best arm wrestling brain, you know, because I'm sure there's some guys who, you know, have a have a way of uh, avoiding that. I know. I feel I've always been good at slipping things. <laughs> right. Just, uh, I don't know. See, there's that an admittance that you you keep falling off the arm, the, uh, the 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 boulders. No, I, mean, <laughs> I, I, I think I've always been good at intentionally like wriggling out of stuff. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm pretty good at that, yeah. I know, we used so to play a game called Mercy at school. Oh yeah, we used to do that a lot. I'm so bad at that, but I was always yeah, good at tricking um, them into saying Oh words. yeah, you'd always get some tit who twisted his, did the twisty thing. I mean, I'd yeah. always be losing, but I'd, I'd just try and get them to go trick them into it. I thought it was a bit mean. <laughs> no, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, do I have any other options? Yeah. Go. Oh, no, you got it. Um, uh, uh, you let me hold you then. Yeah. So, um, you've got to be careful not to let me grip you. Okay. That one was literally, old oh, hold and bend. Yeah. Yeah. I, so. yeah. yeah. I wonder what I can do against the hold and bend. I'm trying yeah. to make it hard for you to, to hold up. <laughs> nope, you've still got it up. 
Um, do you want to do a little bit of this? Yes, oh yes. Yeah, I mean, sometimes there's that feeling, oh no, the guy's gripping me too much, you know, as I walk doing it. So, you, the answer is, you either get out of my way out, or you go way in. Okay. So one option, very realistic option, especially if you're that medium size, yeah. you're not like a seven foot, you're not very short, is take that middle road, go deep in, yeah. and, and sort of, you know, it's a bit like this whole thing where, you know, the guy's grabbing around here on you. Yeah. A lot of guys do that on me. I mean, well, okay, let him do it. But then I can, I, I you know, I don't like starting off like that because yeah. I've got nothing to go into. But then equally, I can run away with him. Yeah. Um, but I'd rather, uh, I'd rather force him in. Yeah. And, um, okay, left. I'm going to see if I can... It's <laughs> good. <laughs> yeah. Those thumbs are too strong. <laughs> Careful about the old sideways pressures. Yeah, I felt I had. I think you were. My body. You're pretty good. Um, just like you know, as long as you're sort of aware of it. Yeah. I don't know. I, I think uh, it helps that I've got short arm safety wise. Very difficult to get into the open arm twisty shape uh. when I'm little. Hello guys. Hello. Oh, moment. Oh, Aesthetics, really. How would you set up? Imagine he's the bar, yeah. and how would you hang off of him? Yeah. Know? Yeah. All right. So that good stuff. Yeah. Get your elbow out of the way on the left. Just give yourself somewhere to go, and and My you, elbow. yeah, and just make sure you're you're facing me as you go as you go towards the pad. All right. Yeah. Good, good. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Go. Ah, uh, yeah. That's what you mean by different. <laughs> <laughs> Told you he's yeah. strong. <laughs> he is strong. <laughs> right. Have you tried hooking into him? No. I don't know if I want to. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's just a lot. That's a wrist and a half, isn't it? <laughs> I don't think my elbow was uh, warmed up for this. It just is a bit like you. <laughs> it you, you can you can reduce the side pressure if yeah, you were to turn way. more this way. Yeah, then it's a bit less pressure on the oh, elbow. Yeah, yeah. yeah you see. But then I don't pull this way. <laughs> this no, I know. It, it means it's harder to actually. It's more of a defensive thing. It's it's harder uh, to pull out of it, yeah. but it protects your arm a bit more. If, you, you, yeah, if I've got a guy, if I'm against a guy I know is a lunatic, you know, in a match, you know, I've, I've been against guys who are famous for just going straight sideways, yeah. so I've, I've turned on to them, oh, you know, yeah. and then at least I know that I'm not going to get broken, you know? <laughs> but, but, you know, it, sometimes you have to pick your battles and you know you're going to survive. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, I see fair. what I can do. Yeah, you're really strong. <laughs> oh, my elbow's a bit fucked yeah. already. <laughs> it's interesting seeing the different strengths, like I can feel uh, yeah, different ways you work. I don't want to send this to Yeah. <laughs> oh, really? Go for it. Okay. <laughs> I didn't need a rope. You ready? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Good. Oh, that missed of yours. That is amazing. <laughs> so <Yeah>. strong. <laughs> That's the awesome man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay. man. Right. Yeah, go. go. Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 oh, I'll let you guys practice bombs <laughs> one already. Oh, you are. So, is that the, wh the which is the, yeah, which is more painful for you? 
Um, what, what part of my arm? On your leg. Is it better on your right hand or your left hand? Um, my, my left arm is definitely better for your foot. Um, worse for my foot. So I can't oh, put. So we'll be careful. Yeah, I can't put. So normally when I'm pulling, because I'm just on my right foot, I could pull, pull, like, pull back like that. Okay. Whereas my left foot, I can't. Well, again, you could deliberately turn your body the other way. You could, yeah. deli you could deliberately try. Um, see, see, how, see what happens. <laughs> um, got the, the walking, walking, walking <laughs> wrist here. Yeah, yeah, you want Oh, that wrist is strong. <laughs> <laughs> so, just to, when you're setting up, set up up here. Okay. And it gives him something harder for him to work into. Ah, uh, yeah. Ready? Yeah. 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 So if I come in. Okay. It's in my back. Yeah. Well, the way you just grabbed your hand yeah. and moved it. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, good, good, good. <laughs> <laughs> You're in a good position. Uh, rather than trying to win off that position, try and keep the pressure on him and stuff. No, no, keep there. That's a good position there. Mm -hmm. Stay there. Yeah. And then see what he has to do with it. Oh! <laughs> I thought you were holding him. I thought. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, was it was. It was no, no. Yeah, it's unbelievable. <laughs> Getting the angle on me. Yeah, well, it's the kind of knowledge. Yeah, it's the angle. It's like yeah. because you've you've got my thumb here. It seems mm. like well, when, you're I, when you're I push through there, my thumb. yeah, you're you're I'm playing into your thumb. Yeah, so, so you like I'm, I'm putting the energy to hurt myself. Yeah, yeah, so you need to start doing what's called a dragging type roll when you're starting to go around the outside. Make some space yeah. and, and then put pressure on me. So. Um, the, otherwise, if you play into my thumb, it's like, well, you know. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> like traditionally, with for me with arm wrestling, um, when I've noticed when you do it, so just mm. I, I think I can show you better with this. One. Like you hold quite high up. Mm, I'm, I'm a high yeah. Good guy. Yeah. And I've always, always like to go as tight as possible. I've always oh, liked to go. Oh yeah. I'm the same. I haven't. Yeah, I haven't tried possible. gripping low, but I don't think it works. It's not a good idea for me to grip low on my left. I can see what the difference is. Did it make a difference? Oh yeah, yeah. I already thought I would. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so if you were, if you were... That's not, not great for me, that. If you were like this. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. Loosen up a bit. So if you were like that. Yeah. That would feel good for me. Yeah, whereas, it's an, an horrible for me. Whereas, yeah, <laughs> because you're like that. Yeah. When I do go for it, it feels like it's yeah. going against this. Especially when yeah. I put my strength on it. Yeah. I had that a lot too. I found if I, if I kept my hand looser, like if I, I'll show you when I meant. Like if I kept my fingers like here and I tried to keep mm. some distance there and mm -hmm. kept that in and tried to get my thumb under, mm -hmm. then that really helped with the thumb. Oh, Especially like if, if he started hurting my thumb, I found if I pushed with my, like, pushed my like, tricep, mm. it helps as well. I don't know. Yeah, because what yeah. happens mm. there is because I'm relying on some his thumb going somewhere if I was to push forwards. Yeah. If he's already pushing into it, then it's like it's just going to open myself up. So potentially, it's sort of that can help. Oh, that's um, interesting. That's yeah, cool. I could deliberately grip low, so go out of my comfort zone there. See, we'll see what we, what we can do. Okay. So it's just oh, go yeah. Yeah, that, oh, good. yeah, that feels really. Yeah. I can, uh, control you really oh, yeah, easily. Now I feel like a mortal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Like before, when it was higher, even when I just get to there. Yeah, yeah, I can't. And I know once I get used to there, I'm pretty can't sure. Do anything with that. Go, yeah, go for it. Go. It'll be really hard for you to fight back. So once, once I get you there, it'll be very yeah, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, when you grip high, 
I can't get in that position. No. Oh. And when I get in that position, it feels like I'm like three, four times strong. As soon as I get there. We well, probably are. You're applying three or four times more power. Most likely, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Interesting. Yes. <laughs> um, um, okay, so you didn't like the left. So, so uh, see if you can make something on the left. Yeah, you wanted yeah. to practice that. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's, there's, there's an idea. You know, I like it when um, you get people who are new mm. coming up with ideas, plans, sort of, you know, sort of bouncing ideas off each other. Yeah. You know, there's going to be things that you can find that, that can improve both of your games. Yeah. You know? I mean, for instance, you're relying on literally grabbing his hand like a ball and moving it. Yeah. That's basically how you've been winning. But a lot of guys are very good at holding this position, so you you know you wouldn't be able to do that. Mm. So you might. I would like that. Well, because they've yeah. got such a stable hand, it's, yeah. you can't just grab it and bully them out. You know, uh, there's a lot of guys who you can't bully. Um, it's easy. Um, so it's sort of um, you would have to find a way around it. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I mean, the fact that you're going to a negative hand now, I would usually say that's terrible. But because you've got such a strong mobile hand, it's not causing you a problem. And in a pro match, you'd always want to stay on the positive or the neutral hand or positive. You'd never go into the negative. So if anyone's wondering on the video, I'm just saying that's the negative. It's usually you, you're really strong, so you're able to power through there. But, but usually you want to stay there all positive. Yeah, it feels like you're doing that just to get a better a full group. Just to hold on to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> because you're out there, so I'm like, yeah. yeah. But then once it gets hold on to you, I feel like it's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Know, maybe it doesn't. Which, I mean, I think you can. Very you impressive can. you can do it from that angle. <laughs> yeah. I think that's a good stance. Get um, used to it from pull ups, I think. Yeah. Alright, alright, all right, so let's try some stuff. Yeah, so you start away. Oh, I should just give them the flame back. Your, um, I think this is your pterodactyl over here. Shall I throw it over? Oh, yes, please. Thank <laughs> you. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're just trying to wonder where you're putting the pressure. You're putting it downwards, aren't well, you? Well, I was trying different things, seeing yeah. it. Mean, I, I tried that before in Jerome, and I found that it really. I think that helped. Yeah, it. that felt like you were strong. Like when I was doing that, it felt um, like I could get his wrist um, better. What was you doing to put yourself? Um, yeah, no, I was, I was pushing down. down. I was like trying to extend my tricep. Yeah. And like push you over off the pad. Ah, oh, right, that's right, what yeah. I do. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's great. He's having to really drag onto it. <laughs> that's a massive difference. Uh, you know what? In doing that, you're giving, giving him a smaller contact to grab. Me. He's physically <laughs> less. Yeah, it. he's physically less able to grab your hand. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm noticing how much like the difference between like because my hand is doing like my mm. wrist is bending here. Nasty, my it? hand is at that angle. Oh yeah. yeah. I don't know, like it doesn't hurt. I'm just wondering if that's just Oof, too yeah. much flexibility. Well, it's like you I are a bit hyper flexible, aren't you? Yeah. Um, hello. Hi. <laughs> um, because it was only, what was it, like 15 minutes at the most I ordered it, so I don't think it'll be ready yet. So. Shiny new table. Yay. Yeah, and look, I've put the, I managed to get the handle to fit in the other table. Oh, oh probably towards me. Definitely got the edge now. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. Okay, yeah. You have crazy strength, so I'm just trying to keep like <laughs> uh, my whole strategy now is like get it into your fingers and <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. anywhere you have less. <laughs> I'll try and hold you just now. Yeah. So. Yeah. I mean, you, you, I don't know, you're pretty gentle letting me get that position in the first place, but is there anything you want to try? Uh, yeah, let me, I always do this. Yeah. So maybe I'll try this. Try, I mean, I found it helps when I. I had my fingers like loose, so I had them like there, just like really pulling into that. And then I was, I was trying to like, I, I was trying to break their wrist backs. Yeah. Uh, so you twist that way, and you you want to pull, especially with like these fingers, yeah. and twist there, so you can like get some rotation. That's what I've been trying to do mm. all the time, and I found that helped me. Yeah. Um, I don't know now, if it's if good you, for you. 
If you try rotating without the contact, it's not much help. You've got to have something to rotate to. Oh, right. So, so uh, it's not about being tight. It's about having quality of contact on this side of the yeah. uh, on the on top of the side. hand. If you've got if your ovary is done, you've got nothing to rotate oh, okay. to. Okay. Right. I thought I could do it with you. I I, I felt if I got my well, you've got Maybe long you've just fingers. got big thumbs, so that's more. <laughs> yeah, just control his thumb, <laughs> control that. Uh, I've not got massive ones, but, but proportionally. Uh, no, I feel it, it. the bone on your thumb is like, it's it's enough to get a grip yeah, on. Yeah, I mean, it's a strong thumb. So yeah, it's sort of a I think that must But be this it. one, if you get good just quality contact on here, it should give you enough to push. Yeah. I've seen people push. You do have a habit of grabbing uh, too far around. Again, if you grab too much, you've got nothing to move on. So you need a little bit of space to move to, yeah. but not so far that you're pushing into the wrong part of the hand. So what about that? Yeah, just line them up along the top there. Preferably, I mean, if you can get your index finger near to this knuckle up here. Yeah. You see, that's an easy, that's oh, yeah. putting him under wow. pressure. Massive difference. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, you have to line the birds up on the cliff and then yeah. push them. L line up the lemmings and then drop them off the cliff. You know. yeah. <laughs> yeah, that uh, leanness. Some some guys they'll they'll even have a low hand and angle the fingers up, and then they'll aim with that high setup. So it means that their knuckle is relatively low on the finger. It means they can put all that cupping power into uh, yeah, just for that. So, but you have to be able to get into that angle. Some I can't actually get my fingers up in that angle. Yeah. But some guys they're flexible enough to get up into that. You mm -hmm. know? Yeah. yeah, and they can really so push through those knuckles. If, if, uh, try to resist. I'm, I'm not going to push okay. now, but try yeah. to resist the. Yeah, you scroll it straight there. So if I were to pull up. I can't pull you through this, but if I was to pull up there. You've got something to press on. Yeah, it's still, still hard for me. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I imagine on your right you can just press through Maybe. Because yeah, yeah, <laughs> you've got that very strong hand on your, your, your right. I think I've yeah. found that move works for me pretty well. I, you said a lot of rock climbing, which is like a lot of strength in here. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. I guess if you're doing bar stuff, it's more kind of yeah, it's strength. Just like yeah, it's, it's, it's funny. You're, you're learning to get around There's his grip. I noticed the first session yeah. they were telling me like, your wrists are fairly strong, your fingertips are strong, but like that isn't very strong. And I, I, I went home and I started playing around. It's like, wow, that really isn't very strong. Like every time I'm hanging on something, I'm hanging like that. Yeah, you're, you're, you're. Oh, that uh, what, what's the, strength. what's the smallest yeah. crimp called? The crimp. The smaller one. I mean, that's oh. Um, the when you lie on your fingertips. Crimp. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's a cramp, and then that's open. just open. Oh, you train a lot with that as well, like uh, uh, well, just in rock climbing. Like it's mm -hmm. if you crimp too much, you can. I'd always pull. Yeah, like, I've, I've heard of these the, the little things yeah, that they things. can come away. Oh wow! I yeah. kept on doing that, and I. Well, what, they come away, and then you yeah, they can back? Uh, they can come away in that direction. So they can what? come away from. Um, so you see the tendon goes around there, yeah. it doesn't naturally go around there, it's actually got some little loops that, yeah, that goes through, in. little ligaments. Oh what, and then you got to push the, it back the ligaments can come away from the bone. I mean like... And then what happens? Well, they, they literally, yeah. I think they have to do surgery. I mean, I mean I, I'd feel like I damaged something, so I'd take a break and it would get better by itself, but like... Mm. Well, yeah, I, you, I think it, people, it, a lot of people have done it, it's like... Um, yeah. there's, there's guys I've seen on YouTube who've complained about like, losing... The tendon comes out. Yeah. 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 I've done some rock climbing, uh, wall climbing, but not a lot. I think I've done about 10 sessions in total. Mm -hmm. It's been fun. Yeah. <laughs> then I went with my missus where we, we, you lay, I think it was? Yeah. Yeah, yeah and um, the one in Hemel Hampstead, I'm not sure if you guys seen it, Ooh, super, super, mm. super. So I climbed all the way up. Then I've looked down, and she's like 47, 48 kgs, uh, I'm about 80 odd. <laughs> so then I've let go, coming down, and then I see her losing control, like, oh, oh stepping, stepping around and everything. I'm like, oh, shit, man, I'm scared of my, yeah. scared for my life. Oh, there's most of them, you'll be attached to the ground as well. And yeah, we didn't. just friction on the thing. We didn't do that, so, so we just had it around her, and okay. then she was holding on to something. Yeah. yeah, so I'm thinking, oh, man, if it's <laughs> slipped or anything, I'm yeah. gone. So yeah, mm. after that I was a bit scared. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't go back. <laughs> I've done a lot of abseiling in my time, but not rock climbing. 
So I did a little bit of rock climbing, mm. but not a uh, but proper rock climbing. I've never done. Mm. Oh, I've never done proper. I've only I've only ever done actual cliff. Yeah. But, oh, but, nice. but the thing that um, there was always weather tether. Yeah. Uh, and uh, I mean, I wouldn't do free climbing, mm. but I used to do. You know, I I I'd do the old classic lean off and then go down the cliff. You know. Yeah. 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 The first few times, always scary, isn't it? Well, it's the when you're trusting yourself, you're leaning back and you're trusting the knot, you know, and, yeah. um, and, and having to just be, it's that first little bit where I always, yeah. and then it's just getting a rhythm. fun after that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, true. You can put a pull up by here. Yeah, well, I've got two in the house, but oh, we yeah. hang the washing off them. Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, I'm surprised you don't get one like this, but do well uh, somewhere. Good, I suppose, but good for your training. Good for your yeah, grip training. but it's like <laughs> the fact that I don't. Well, no, uh, I never do chin ups during grip um, oh, yeah. training because uh, it kills your grip. Oh, yeah. Oh, just I want to. What I'll do after August, so I've got the big competition in Finland. I want to get back onto the arm wrestling training, and I'm gonna. I'm determined. I'm gonna get to be able to do those one arm chin ups. So I got close. I managed to do like one. Um, before you know, I was getting there, but I was getting so sore, and then, uh, and then I end up getting back into the grip. So um, I, I'm gonna, I'm determined for November for the pros. I want to be another level. You know, the easiest way is just lose weight. Well, I've, I, I always have to lose weight because it's under 65 kilos. Oh, you'd be right. Lose, lose 10, 15 kgs and yeah, well, one arm pull-ups, no problem. Yeah, but I couldn't usually do them even when I was light because I didn't have the flexibility. Mm. So I've been improving on my posture in order to do it. So actually, I wouldn't have been able to do it previously. Um, just even if I was really light, I physically wouldn't be able to, you know, it wouldn't close. You know, so, um, so I couldn't apply, I couldn't. Uh, connect to my power. Right. Um, so I've never been a good uh, one arm. My brother, he could do one arm chin ups, uh, but he's always been more flexible, better habits. You know. What's a good progression to get that? Uh, you can use resistant bands. Okay. Yeah, like, yeah, you know, another thing, you can literally um, put a rubber band there and, and just um, literally with your uh, rubber band on your other hand. Okay. You know. yeah. and, and that's better than, than this. You know. Yeah. Uh, or you could um, kind of stretch your other arm, so let's just say you're practicing on your right arm, stretch your other arm as, as wide as possible. Mm. Um, this will help, and then if, if it gets too easy, you could use four fingers, then three, then two. Oh, and yeah. once you get to one finger, you more or less... What are you, you stretching fingers, your other arm for? Uh, stretching your head on something. Oh, you're per touching something. Yeah, um, so it's, it's kind of like a... On, yeah. on, a, on a frame or something? Yeah, so it's, it's kind of like how much can you... how much can you pull just by mm. doing this? And just by doing this, I don't know, you may be able to pull half your body weight, but if you use four fingers, you may not be able to. Then you use three fingers, yeah. you definitely can't pull half your body weight, <laughs> so you're definitely using less. You get to use two fingers. That's clever. If you could pull yourself up, you more or less could let go, and you should be able to hold for about five seconds. Ah, Once cool. you get two fingers. I, I used to do holds only. Mm. You know, I've never I've never done that. I always used to do oh, this. Static, yeah. yeah. So it's sort of a... Uh, Probably more useful for armor thing. Yeah, but it was sure. more useful when I was doing hook and drag. Now I don't do hook and drag because, like, well, I, mm, I don't know how useful it is. <laughs> okay, hook um, and drag. What's that game position? And it's yeah. So, arm wrestling. A little bit of arm wrestling. I'm gonna uh, before the food turns up. So it's a bit of a late. It, it's um. Better to do something than nothing. You know, yeah, of course. Yeah, I feel this has helped consolidate all of my ideas. Yeah. So that's good. I'm gonna face you. My fingers up there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm doing this thing right. Go for it. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> so what have you got? What have you done to get me down? I'm, I'm forcing you into a hook. Oh, right. But uh, it's forcing up here. Yeah. If I went down there, you could probably open yeah. me up. So I'm trying, to, it's, I'm trying to just get you high enough that I'm not kind of completely yeah. throwing it away. Yeah. yeah. I found that to row pulling out this way is like yeah. countering a lot of his stuff. 
Yep, so if I'm doing this, go. You see, I'm yeah, pulling you over. Ah, uh, but then I can topple you. So you're gonna be, you're gonna keep it in here. Yeah. Uh, I'm, you mustn't let me get, get you onto my side. Okay. Um, so, so it's just about ways of keeping me on, on your side. Remember, I've got a short arm, so as soon as I get over to your side, I'm massively compromised. Yeah. So <laughs> there's no way I can put, apply a lot of my strength if you get me on your side. Get me on your side anywhere, and I'll be, you know, in trouble. Yeah. So go for it. Yeah, that's not bad. <laughs> yep, good. Oh, <laughs> let me run away. <laughs> uh, you've got, I tell you what, if you can keep me up there, perfect. Keep you up there. Bit of hand, just hand control. Yeah, hand control. Yeah. Go. Yep. Yep, yep. Go. Yep. Go. Yep. 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 So I don't want to cause you pain when you have to put this. That was good, you almost had me there. That was actually very good. Um, um, remember, a little bit more honest contact, and I won't be able to do it. Yeah. Just, uh, yeah, just hold it. Yeah, yeah sometimes um, just a little bit more patience. You know, you, if, you, if you keep good quality of contact, then uh, you can just stop me from running away from you, you know. Yeah. 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 So, yeah, just stop me from running away. Stop from like, put the power over there. No, but you can stop me, and then you can work. Sometimes it's a two part thing, so you need to stop me and then beat me. Okay, cool. Stop yeah. you then beat you? Yeah, go for it. That's probably too strong now. Oh, you got a good wrist though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ah, good, you're getting better, my <laughs> goodness, yeah. Oh, my brick buff. That's all right. Do you want to try some of the things again? Yeah, I could do. Cool. Yeah. Change it around, please. Oh, I'm loving my new table. It's so much. It looks like uh, it's a bit of a tight fit, aren't they? Yeah. Oh. That's <laughs> good. At least you know it's going to be secure. Yeah, yeah. No I'm used to them being loose as hell. Yeah. Oh, have you got a, um, what's that thing, the straps as well? Uh, straps, straps. Oh, yes, yeah, I've got, uh, did you want to do that? You can try one, I haven't yeah. tried it before. You've never tried straps either. You haven't tried straps? Yeah, I yeah. think yeah. 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 What's the difference? Because I feel like escaping is something I'm okay with. Yeah, I, I, always forget, <laughs> I always forget how to do it. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm rubbish at it, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, so I think, you, yeah, you basically. Know. So hang on, yeah, I think like that. Forget, yeah. And then, yeah. Yeah. And then hold that. Can't yeah. 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 Yeah, it's definitely. That's definitely a proper strap position. <laughs> Wait, is that tight That's enough? Weird. Oh well, of course. Like, I've got big advantage now. Uh, yeah, I'm not mistaken. <laughs> <laughs> oh really? Yeah. Cool. Oh, that feels good. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That I don't think helps me. <laughs> no, but you could. You could. Um, so again, you can hook into a strap. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. feel my hook will not 
Help oh. me. He's gonna make <laughs> I'll it. Give it a go. Oh, yeah, well, that's good. Yeah, that's not bad. <laughs> Turn that into a top ball at the end. <laughs> that's good. So, full <laughs> way, full way. Turn, turn, turn. <laughs> I love how it's. <laughs> Oh, that's, <laughs> that, that's illegal. He has to have one foot on the floor. I mean, I don't know what to do if he can just hold it. <laughs> oh, that's good. Uh, that was good. I couldn't fight that back. Oh, okay. Okay, that's quality. Uh, Alright, I'll try something you else. You know, um, if you were to keep a bit more of it, mm. then, then do that. Yeah. So don't do that straight away. Okay. okay. Then you've got a little bit of movement. You know, movement is more likely to compromise your opponent. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, finish that. Oh, okay. <laughs> cool, that won't be long. Right, you go? Yeah. Nice. Oh, good. So now my arm's stretched out. So yeah, I've got, I mean, I've held it way over to my side, but you're still like holding on pretty well. <laughs> but you've 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 basically stopped him. Yeah, it's <laughs> good. In, in in a proper match, you'd just be the I'm just holding. Coach would be telling, stay there. I would. I would. That's not enough. Uh, I can do. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, anything you want to try? <laughs> I'll see if I can. I'm, I'm, I'm impressed you're not not both complaining about the stuff. Because I, I hate stuff, so it tears the hell out of me because mm -hmm. of the way my wrist, uh, the way I arm wrestle. Yeah, that's where we're like, oh, it's not different. too bad for you. I can feel it, but it, it's not. Oh, I'm so I mean, pleased that you're able to train with this more often. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Alright, Eddie? Yeah. I'm liking how much force I can cut through. Just things. a little hint, right? So you'll start, this is negative, you want to try and flatten your hand out. That's alright, don't worry about that. Well, think about the top of your hand here. Don't worry about that, look at your hand position. Okay. Yeah, people prefer low strap. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. A lot of pros go with the low strap, as low as you can get it. So, try and think about this pressure in this direction, okay? And that's going to prevent him from, or not prevent him, but it's going to reduce the chance of going to the negative. Yeah. So you want to be encouraging this in this direction. Can you imagine this through down through here? Yeah. On the top of your hand? Okay. Yeah. That's better. That is a lot better. <laughs> Yeah, try not to push <laughs> sideways when you're a yeah. beginner, you know. <laughs> yeah, if, if you feel like you have to go sideways, bring your shoulder around and pull away in that yeah, direction. Yeah, 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 because then at least you'll just put it on the bicep yeah, rather I than... I feel like you've got great... Yeah, like, I, my biceps always give up <laughs> before other bits, but I feel you can probably... <laughs> no oxygen. <laughs> yeah, so I did. people don't usually have to stay on the strap that long. Going into some good habits here of getting those angles on his hand. You got your you're pressing in the right position. Looking great. Really, really good. Yeah, that's good. You'll be yeah. in a better position if you were to bring your elbow forward. Okay. And and hand back. Okay. I I, I don't like the feeling of that, but I'll no, keep it. No, but you've got something to pull into it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Pull you to me. Yeah. Very good. Physically bringing him. Near a nice little moon shake you want to okay. do with your elbow. Yeah. Um, the drag is it, that little movement in the elbow can translate to a lot more on the hand end. Yeah. So many, many inches of movement on your hand can be only maybe one inch on the elbow. Okay. So use it. Fair use the drag. Yeah. My arm is like pink strawberry. Yeah, maybe we should uh, 
Maybe we should take this strap off. Yeah. Yeah. You don't want to look the same. Yeah, you want got no pressure. Right? <laughs> Shall we, shall we give you some blood we supply can back to you? the other way, see if that thing... <laughs> cool. Well... Well, there you go. you got an idea of it. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's quite fun. Oh, yeah, that's kind of fun. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, an, I'm not a fan of it, but no. I mean, it's something I'm having to, having to do with my life. So, um... How do you pull it on? Should we practice trying to pull it on? Um... So, practice what? Try just, just pull it on. Oh. Yeah, so basically, um, so you want to be in a position where you can fall down through through the. Yeah, so, so it goes. Um, Do we want to try the other way this side? Because I think that was. The way we did it before meant there was more. Oh, sorry, you pull on that side. Yeah. Uh, I'm not too sure. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm terrible. Because before the strap was on your hands, maybe if yeah, we put it on this yeah. one, it would be less. Yeah, they always say uh, there is a there is a debate as to yeah. um, the guy who gets the buckle side and um, they they say he has the disadvantage. Okay. But then, uh, but the Ryan Bowen recently found that that it, he um, didn't mind it at all. <laughs> <laughs> I feel there's always going to be things like that where people. Can you gonna... put it that side? I mean, having said that, anyone who was to train with deliberately with the buckle on, in their hand um, every time, they're going to get good at it. Yeah. So yeah, it's you know it, it's not necessarily always going to be a disadvantage. Yeah, that's a very good. loose strap. <laughs> uh, I do feel a squeezing moment. <laughs> really? Yeah. That oh, feels the same to me. <laughs> <laughs> So, if you were to try and make something it from the start, could, well, wait, wait. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so try and be try and be dictating yeah. off the start here. Right. Yeah. Remember what I was saying through the fingertips, through in this direction. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Do you keep yeah. let, letting go. Why do you keep letting go? Get get pushes. Yeah. No, no, it's about quality of contact. <laughs> no, you're losing it. Interesting. No. Yeah. The strap's pushing right here. Yeah, yeah. So when when the strap's pushing, the strap's pulling me. Go well that so way. I feel that's you're helping gonna, me because yeah. I can I can get a lot of force. It was before when I was talking about how my hand was moving, more, like my wrist would move and my hand would stay the same place. This is preventing. He's that. able to work with the strap. You so need to no. find a way of working with the strap. Yeah. yeah. Get used to that wrist. You, you tend to keep a very uh, inflexible Let's wrist. Have a play I'll, I'll try and deliberately move that wrist around it. Yeah, I can't, I can't move with this. Although I am trying to resist that, but yeah. yeah. I if, I, if I didn't resist it so hard. Uh, <laughs> I've lost some flexibility. Okay. Well, I mean, it will help. Yeah, I don't think it can't strong. go that way. I normally arm wrestle that way. Can't go that. Because I can still. still work. That, that's interesting. Yeah, yeah, it must be the, the size of. If the buckle was on the other side, maybe. You well, the buckle was on this side on the first go. Yeah, so. you had the same problem, didn't you? Is I've, I've got this going below like my bone, and I'm wondering. Oh, oh no, my one's on top of my okay. bone. Okay. Uh, that might be why. I think I've got lumpy wrist bones, which probably helps. <laughs> if I try to put the strap on. It's really low. Yeah. Oh. I mean, you're allowed to ask for that strap. Oh, in a match, just remember that. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to really uh, be determined to get it the way you want All it. Alright, feeling. Yeah, it's going to twist. Maybe I've just lost my strength. <laughs> no, <laughs> you definitely still have some. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's a massive difference. Uh, your setup's getting very low. You, you've just got to keep. You're going to be t t twist this way. Your hand. You, you, oh. you, you're going to make something of it. Okay. 
yeah. <laughs> I mean, off the go, you don't you don't start off like yeah. that. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So this is looking good. Yeah. So yeah, go. Yeah, it's a whole. Yeah, it, hell of a lot better. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, from here I feel I can. Yeah. But you've got to be really careful where your hand's placed, because the, the yeah. wrong place and it'll just yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, every true. time. Yeah. Well, no. <laughs> I don't like this. Uh, doing your tri doing yeah. your tricep press when your elbows off the. You, you've like got to get onto your arm or, or not at all. Yeah. What, what now, tricep press has to be on top of your arm. Oh, okay. If you're over here, it's very illegal, very dangerous. Illegal. I don't, don't like it. Could you oh. literally break your own arm? Okay. Please don't. Oh, I, I do not want to do that. No. Okay. How was that? How did that look? So if I was yeah. the, the bone line was over here. It just needs to be inside this bone line. So yeah, I'm not going to resist one. Because yeah. I, I, so I, you, like you, I, I don't want you to be doing the tricep doing press out here somewhere. Yeah. You, you want to get on top of it. Okay. Yeah. It's called like a tricep it. press because you get on top of it. You're literally pushing your arm over yeah. together. No, it just looked a little bit. No, fair enough. I, I appreciate you telling me I don't want to break it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure yeah. it wouldn't have broken, but I just. I mean, I'm doing my good job of not yeah. getting habits. So. Bad <laughs> habits. <laughs> you end up being one of those guys who miraculously maybe don't bug his arm, but you end up with a really weird shaped arm because yeah. you get so into such bad habits. <laughs> Don't you feel that if you this was over here, you'd have a better chance? If what? If you if you, if you, if you were to be pulling, I mean, it's easier said than done. Isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> You've got a very low grip on them there. You're way down the bottom of this thumb. <laughs> I think let's uh, show you call it down the strap there. Okay. I, I just think you know you're going to be bruised to hell. Enough. <laughs> Especially if this is the first time, you know. Yeah, it's you true. Know, you're really it does, it does you out. It's good. I like yeah. it. Oh, it's good. Yeah, it's, it's all right. I do have <laughs> to go <laughs> pretty soon. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. that's right. That was all soon. So he's gonna eat anyway. So yeah. Um, I was wow, wondering. That, that strap was good. Yeah, and that was really fun. That was very different. I just practiced that one. <laughs> I guess you could do some right. Oh. My arm's gone. Oh, there. sorry. Yeah, yeah. It could be a bit of a <laughs> you're in front of the camera, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that strap took no, me out. It's the good. strap was in a position. Oh, sorry. That strap was in a position where if I was to put as much strap as I can, mm. I'll still be like this. <laughs> oh, I, yeah, I weren't yeah. able to turn it to me. Yeah, well, well I know. Because I would be turning that direction. Yeah. 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 Slog on the right and then we'll call it a day. It's nice, it's so good to hear someone mentioning Hemel Hempstead. It's like one of the places of my youth. Oh, yeah, yeah. is that where you grew up? <laughs> well, I'm from Watford, so I'm from that on oh, West Park. That's Watford. Yeah. Oh, right around there. No, I found a bit yeah. weird. My dad is called Andrew Smith as well. So oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I bet there's quite a few around there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that. <laughs> I'm not sure what, yeah, I just... Um, oh, you know what I'm feeling? That was good. Yeah. The pronator I'm feeling. Right. Yeah, it's only I need to train. Yeah. 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 And then I'll be playing into your arm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll play into your arm, won't I? Again, you just need to sort of. Um, it's always a good idea to keep a high hand if you can. Yeah. Keep a high hand. Like this, encourage some nice That's a, just a stronger shape. Right. And it, it's a lot harder for me to bully you if you're up there. 
because even if you're if I pull you down to me if you're if you've got a nice shape you know you've got you you can you can um, you're you've got access to that power yeah you've got access to a bit of that you know how come you're wearing this warm coat <laughs> I <don't know. laughs> I'm sweating for it as well yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah, it's the sort of thing people do to lose weight. No, I just, I just didn't want to take it off because last time I messed up my elbow. Oh, oh. messed up your elbow. Oh, the remember I had the plaster there. Like Sorry, that. yes, he was uh, he was getting friction burned. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is. Uh, there you go. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking these Mazarenko pads are a little bit friendlier. What do you reckon? No, it was on Andrews. But his is uh, 2013, it's 10 years old, so oh, it might be, yeah. you know, it's it maybe, yeah. Yeah. Say, You're a lot more intimidating to arm wrestle without the jacket on. <laughs> <laughs> it always looks good for the, uh, um, you know, when I do it on YouTube, I'll get a still that looks really cool. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. go for it. Right. it. Yep. Just thinking which way I'm going to pull you out. Yep. I'll pull you out. <laughs> yes, <laughs> so that would have been fun to start, wouldn't it? Does yeah. that count as a. As I don't know, it does. Yeah, if it, it, it comes out, slip. then yeah, you go to the strap. Yeah, not a full slip. Unless you can catch them and then. Yeah. 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 Well, I wouldn't want to catch them because my thumb will break. No, if you, if <laughs> so, you oh, just yeah. grab his thumb. I think your thumb is stronger than you give it credit. <laughs> No, I mean, the last time I wrestled you, I, I had sore thumbs for about three weeks. So, so, <laughs> yeah, uh, it's been three weeks, it's just recovered. Yeah. Sorry, sorry dude. <laughs> yeah, go for it. Oof. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm not come going anywhere like that, am I? I can see what you're giving me sakes, it's like skin coming yeah. up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I break uh, easily. Yeah, it's yeah. interesting. Don't let my whole arm get through. <laughs> my yeah. skin comes up. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what am I going to do? I'll try something else. I'll probably go in, in your favour. <laughs> oh, maybe. Yeah, go in your favour. Yeah, go. Yeah, yeah that's <laughs> good. <laughs> that <in> my yeah. <laughs> oh, that's good. That was good. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to let that. That's definitely going in your favour. Yeah. 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 Well, that's, that, I do that to prevent you from twisting me that, I don't know which way you twist me. Uh, I don't twist you at all, I push forward. Yeah, that yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. I go that way. But then I end up an extra week that way anyway, so I can't go that way. The only way to beat you is just to go as fast as possible <laughs> straight it's, away. Yeah, yeah there's, a, there's some fast guys out there. Yeah. Because yeah. my, yeah. my strategy was, again, Speed. like try and make him space so yeah. that my thumb could move, pulling away. Uh, if I had space when I pulled away, then it wasn't so bad. Or if I if I pushed him, if I like tried to push his hand back, then again like my thumbs in here and kind of uh, like this bit protected it from push, pushing. You mean push this way? Yeah, yeah, yeah like yeah, it's pushing. Kind of, it's putting the brakes on. I was like trying to push, like thinking about like trying to push his. So he was doing back. what I do on my left. I don't do. It. Funny enough, I don't do it on the, on the right. I kind of push through, and I tend to do back pressure. Yeah. Whereas on my left, I don't do back pressure. I do I I, I, I push down and do a, a, a lap drag. Oh, so it's like quite this. different, isn't it? I, that's a good point. I should try it on my right sometimes. I just I don't know. I've been like trying to do. I don't know. I don't think. I, I think my wrist is a bit too flexible to make it work on my right because yeah. my left is so broken. I definitely noticed on your left that was if it had pushed and yeah. it, it got better. I could try to do what I do on my left, but I don't know if it works. So go. by the ant on my forehead. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> I didn't want to tighten these to the end. I, I, yeah, I, 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 hand, I hand tighten them. I think what I might do is like get, get that properly tightened. Look. Um. Yeah. All right. So, so Elliot. Pushed you like this. Yeah, he was trying to. Yeah. I, I found if I 
If no, I push just... and twist it. Nothing. Yeah, that's good, because then I've got, not got a natural angle on your wrist for me. That's a pretty good idea. And then then if you put the brakes on, you sort of wait for me, wait for the opponent to get impatient on you. Because potentially got... I've got a very hard, it's very difficult for me to... Yeah, when, I'm over, when you're over there and I'm over there. I can't do anything with you, so if you were to wait for the other player to... So it's not necessarily a bad thing that you're in a stalemate because you can wait for the other guy to make a mistake because yeah. then he might like try and do something dark. Yeah. Okay. This is, um, it's a little bit in my, my position as well, so I've probably got a little bit of advantage. Yeah, a little bit of a power advantage, yes. Yeah. I think strength-wise we're very close. It's just it's just about getting you getting me onto your side. Yeah. I would say just try and do it different every time until you find something that doesn't yeah. work. That's how yeah. I figured stuff out in the amateur. Yeah, that's true. Let's go for it. <laughs> nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> I also get more and more ability on my kids. You're very clicky. I thought that was you. <laughs> <laughs> Might be both of us. <laughs> both going <laughs> yeah. I'll try something, but it's not going to work. But oh, really? it goes. Oof. It's a tough roll. <laughs> Flick out. <laughs> oh no, I don't want to dislocate your finger. Yeah. There was a competition I did once where the guy was hanging up my index finger. Oh my, oh, no. no. And it dislocated my index finger. Oh. I was black and blue oh, the next day. No. And the worst thing was, it was a little super match. And um, Chris Waters, and I'd beaten him in the previous tournament. Um, so he. I don't know why he did this because the fact is that he used to beat me quite often. Mm. So we'd kind of, you know, he'd beat me, I'd beat him, you know. So actually, there was a good, every ch he didn't have to do anything silly. But no, he was hanging off my finger. And his coach was saying, don't move, don't move. <laughs> so, so, uh, so then they had. <laughs> okay. But yeah, but stupidly, I entered a open competition afterwards. Uh -huh. So I was completely crippled, and oh. I, I just I didn't win a single pin after that. Oh, yeah. no. so, so so yeah, I, I, I have a painful memory of that. <laughs> just not like that, shall I? Ready? Go. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm slow. I feel a little guy, quite slow. <laughs> no, you're right. Yeah. Oh, I felt the rest of it. That's right. um, I'll probably call it. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah thanks for coming.